give a big hand to DJ Lovato and to the worship team. Amen. So good. Please be seated, everybody. Touch your body beside you. Tell that person God will speak to you today. God will speak to you today. Welcome home. Some of you are crying. Some of you are hurting. Some of you are grieving. Some of you are celebrating. Some of you are very happy. But you belong here. Both of you. This house welcomes everyone. No matter what color your shirt is. This house welcomes you. I want you to know that I have taken a stand. Every single election, I take a stand. People were asking me in the recent campaign, Brother Bo, why don't you take a stand? I told them, I always take a stand in every election. I take a stand for the house that was built in 1980. The first quote-unquote feast, though we did not call it feast yet then, was in the garage of my parents' house. I was 14 years old in that very first feast. I led that prayer meeting. It is God's call for me to stand for that spiritual home that is now in 26 countries. Thousands of people call it their home. I have no choice. In every election, I have to separate my personal choice from my public persona. Why? Because I've got children, many children. And I encourage them to wear a political color, to discern well, and even to campaign, and to go out into the streets. And when my daughter, who wears pink, and my son, who wears red, tells me, Tai, Nai, Samaka, I tell my son and my daughter, thousands of them, Ako yung nana. Kailangan may taong bahay. Kasi dati ang araw, tapos na ang kampanya. Tapos na ang eleksyon. At uuwi kayo sugatan, uuwi kayo butong, uuwi kayo pagod na pagod. Yung iba masayang masaya. Sino ang papakain? Kailangan may magluto. I stand by this house. It's a very difficult choice to stay non-partisan the whole time. Every single election. I came to know Jesus when I was 12. I started serving when I was 13. We started the community. This feast, when I was 14 years old, I'm 55. Do the math. I'm an old man. I've experienced regime changes. I've experienced elections. I stand by the same house. But this house is your safe place. And all those doors are open for anyone, no matter what color your shirt is. Why? You are still my child. And my dear friend, two last things to say before I begin my talk. You want to talk.
y uno va más allá, y uno va al celebrate, que se la pago, si la semana radis, and their candidate won. I want you to know, I celebrate with you. Why? I'm not going to get up. I'm not going to get up. And you know what? That's what democracy is. A person walks with two legs. Pero ana de la administration, opposition. Ni puede que sea So both of you are needed to build this country. Both of you. Behind your shirt, behind the pink shirt, behind the red shirt, behind the technicolor shirt, la tayo. We're all children of God. We all are. And so I invite you to look at that person beside you as your brother and your sister in Christ. That person is made in his image, a God carrier. Nasa sa loob ang Panginoon sa kanya. Respect that person and treat that person as a house of God. No more name calling. No more demeaning. No more bullying. No more looking down at the other person. Kapatid mo yan. Ako ay isang nanay na mulugod sa harapan ng aking mga anak. Please. Mahalin mo isa't isa. Bahay natin ito. Are you ready? Let's all stand. Today I want to preach the message There are blessings at the bottom. Can everybody say that with me? There are blessings at the bottom. Welcome to the book of Jonah, talk three. And we are in this chapter where he gets swallowed up. Tell somebody beside you, there are blessings at the bottom. There are blessings at the bottom. Can I invite you to pray? Put your hand over your chest. Everybody say, Jesus. Jesus. Speak to me more. Speak to me more. Let your word. Let your word. Do its work. Do its work. Lift me up. Lift me Refresh up. Refresh me. Refresh me. 